G'day, NZ Kiwi here again. This time I'm on my T29 Tier 7 American Heavy. Possibly one of the best Tier 7 tanks there is, mainly because of the phenomenal um, armour. We're on highway and I'm heading into town as all uh, heavies normally do. Well, a good number of them normally do. So I move up into position at the end of town here. Just wait to see what pops up. Got a reasonable split, quite a good uh, one, one, one line push. And there's a few tanks in town, although the tanks behind me seem to be a bit scared and not pushing up. So I'm sort of out a little bit by myself here, which is never good. And that's why I decided not to push forward, because I do have very little support behind me. Luckily the uh, opposition haven't realised how alone I am. I continue to back up and give myself a little bit of cover with these um, concrete blocks. T25-2 pops out, and get a shot, and he managed to shoot me, he's firing gold. Probably went through my uh, lower hull. the mistake of popping out again. But one tank down, still pushing on the one line. And again, uh, still my tanks behind me are a little bit uh, hesitant to come forward and back me up. See they've got uh, three tank destroyers and two heavies in um, town. T29 be one of the heavies. AT the T25 AT pops in. And he hits the concrete block. Everybody else misses apart from the T29 that does some damage, and I get to go hit on the ISU. I'm trying to put this. Um, block between me to protect my lower hull, which uh, seemed to have worked because the T29 hit me in the turret and bounced. And again he bounces. TISU-152 is firing HE for some reason, I'm not sure why he's not firing AP because he would have probably gone straight through me. He must have been able to see some of my hull. I'm still a little bit uh, isolated. I've got a KV-3 behind me, but for some reason he's holding back as well. Uh, but we do have another heavy pushing up on my left, which should distract them a bit. So I'm going to move up, because that 152 is pretty sick. In fact, he's dead. And the T-29. Now I'm going to use this body to protect my lower hull. Saw the T29 had fired. Take a shot, pull back. T29's fired again, I think. And just to finish him off. Just a T43. Now I've noticed on the mini map that an IS is in town, uh, is in our base virtually. Um, our AT7 doesn't appear to be moving, but there could be a glitch on the mini map. So he's probably not looking at his mini-map at all. Still close game, 10-9. So I'm now pushing back towards our base. And the IS has killed our artillery. 87 still hasn't moved. Now I'm quite concerned that we might get out capped here. So I'll just speed it up here. Oop. And I'm losing a bit of hull down there, the, uh, using some of the turret armour. And the good gun depression on this. And our AT-7 has woken up and is coming back to attack the IS. And the Pershing gets back to finish him off. So it's 12 all. We've got a T-43, 122-44. Uh, 
and a GW Panther against us. And we've got a Persian that's uh, about 50% and a full health 87. Now I see where the uh, T43 was. He was in town in D1, so I'm going to head there, assuming that he's coming across. And there he is, in fact. He's actually come right across. Um, for some reason, he's sitting in the open. He's moving, but he's pretty much a sitting duck for, uh, for us. If I can hit him. <laughs> the reload. Pick up the last 160 points on him. And now I decide we need to head towards the base but I'm going to still carry on the same way. The Down to the water. Um, we've got the Pershing and the 87 is uh, ready to shoot. The Pershing's moving forward as well. The 87 would better cover me if anything pops up in the city or gets behind me. I'm going to use this little uh, depression here beside the road to give me a hold down in case the uh, tank destroyer is sitting up in the um, city to my left. Oh, and we spot their artillery. It's handy. Shot into him. That person finishes him off. So we're just looking for the 12244, which is still a nasty tank. But for some reason he must have spotted me. I mean my light bulb bent off. Get a shot on the side as he runs across. And the 87 finishes him off for the win. Well, hope you enjoyed that. That was uh, one of my better games in the T29. Till next time.